Hello and welcome. Let's have a quick look at the profile view in Reltio. This screen appears when you click on a particular entity in your search results, and it's your window into the 360 degree view that Reltio delivers. Reltio is unique in its ability to deliver these rich views that combine deep attribution, unlimited relationships, interactions and transactions, and data governance capabilities in a very intuitive user interface. Starting with this profile view, what you'll see is the information laid out in a very easy to use and easy to consume manner. Starting with the universal ID at the top in case I ever want to use this in any of my downstream environments, and then listing all of our attributes and relationships in the main screen. The first thing you may notice here when we look at the name is a little plus two symbol next to the name. This is actually real time survivorship coming into play that's telling me as a user that there's actually two other names for our profile, Mitchell Bergen. In this case, Mitch and Mitchell with one L. However, the current rules that are in place in terms of survivorship are preventing Reltio from displaying this as our golden record, or what we call our operational values, which is essentially what you see on the screen. All those attributes that are populated will appear in this screen. In other words, null values don't have a place in the world of Reltio. And interestingly enough, attributes can have attributes. For example, as I expand this multi-channel communication consent attribute, you can see sub attributes here. The same is at play, for example, when I look at something like phone number or address, etc. Specifically, when we think of phone numbers, addresses and emails, there's data quality routines built into Reltio to be able to decompose phone numbers, figure out whether they're valid or not based on the various patterns in certain countries to perform address validation according to USPS and global address libraries, as well as performing pattern matching or pattern validation on email addresses. The profile view also allows us views into related entities. For example, here I can see that Mitchell Bergen is in the Bergen household, has a relationship to a particular advisor, has family members, has various professional relationships and so on. And clicking on any of these entities would pivot my view on the graph to those particular entities themselves. Coming back up at the top here, you'll also notice a potential matches view. This is giving me a quick window as a user into the fact that there is a possible duplicate that's been found by the Reltio matching engine. If I wanted to, I could click on this and get into more detail to perform a side by side comparison, but I won't do that right now. Looking on the right side, you can see additional facets that are displaying other information. Notice product recommendations, these coming specifically from the Reltio data science module leveraging Apache Spark and down here products that Mitchell Bergen has purchased. This profile view is an extremely rich view of all of the attributes and relationships associated with Mitchell Bergen, along with some data governance capabilities in terms of re reviewing or dealing with potential matches. On the right side of this view, you can see a detailed audit trail going back in time that allows me to look at what this record looked like at a certain point in time. And then down the left side, you'll notice various other icons allowing me, for example, to view the graph, view potential matches, view interactions and transactions, Reltio being very unique in this space in terms of its ability to not only ingest master data and relationships at scale, but also interactions and transactions. Down here, sources, in other words, all of the sources that are contributing to this golden record, as well as a detailed view of the activity log around this particular record. So in summary, very rich views that Reltio delivers in terms of the profile screen in Reltio. And these layouts in terms of where certain things are placed are all under your control as part of your configuration of Reltio. Thank you very much.